friends do this. <laughs> Hey, welcome back to our stupid reactions unit. I'm Corbin. I'm Rick. You can follow us on Instagram and Twitter. Twitter. I'm all juicy. All juicy. It's so Thank you for some patrons. Follow us on Twitter. Can't ring bubble again. Squad. Follow us on our personal YouTube channel. in the description below. Today we're doing a little bit of an informative video. Great. Uh, this is called... Banarasi Sari. Famous Indian silk saris. Cool. So I'm guessing these are how this specific... I don't know how saris are made. Nor do I know <laughs> what are the, what's the typical material that a sari is made from. I don't know. And I'm assuming a silk sari so would be a, nice a higher end kind of sari. Uh, yeah, more ever, expensive. Do you ever buy Andrani a sari? Does she wear saris? Yeah, well, yeah she, she, you, she was wearing a sari. Oh, yeah, she did wear a sari when we went to the screening. Right. Yeah. yeah. I don't know who... Like if every she Indian does, wears she a sari. Looks, does every Indian woman wear a sari at some point? I think. Is it like a dress, essentially? Mm, pretty much. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. And I, I, I love, and I, I said to her, I said, please tell me when you come to America that you're going to feel comfortable and want to be dressed in a sari with your bindi because you look so good. She's like, of course I will do that. I love wearing my sari and my mm -hmm. bindi. I think it's I think it's so beautiful on an Indian I don't think she'll right? definitely have a problem here in Los Angeles. No, uh, not at all. Maybe if she was in like Beaumont, Texas. Yeah, <laughs> then she'd be getting, she's gonna get looks yeah. when she's here because she's gonna look so beautiful. But there's a lot of diversity. Oh, already. all yeah. kinds of looks here. Um, but so this is a little bit of informative. Uh, you know, we like to learn some stuff. Um, so let's just get into this business. This is gonna be cool to watch out if this shows us how they're made. Here we go. बनासी वस्त्र ये कला है हमारे यहाँ कोई भी रॉ मटेरियल पैदा नहीं होता हम सिल्क कहीं से मंगाते हैं जरी कहीं से लेते हैं हम तो सिर्फ अपनी कला उसमें जोड़ देते हैं तभी ये बन पाता है हाथों के कमाल को बनासी कहते हैं हमारा शहर जितना पुराना है उतनी ही पुरानी हमारी ये विविंग सिस्टम है वेस्टर्न की बात है कि वे जिस भी गलियों से गुजरिए तो आपको हैंडलूम की जो खटपट होती है इसके अंदर एक तरंग होती है जो दिमाग को लुभाती है आज के पीरियड में वो आवाज कम जरूर हुई है लेकिन वो अभी भी जिंदा है सिस्टम है पहले हम डिजाइन स्क्रिप्ट तैयार करते हैं और फिर इस ग्राफ को लेकर हम कार्ड पंचर किए जाते हैं जो कार्ड हम पंच करते हैं उनके हर सुराख में डिजाइन छुपा हुआ होता है ये जो ताना है जो कार्ड की मदद से और कार्ड में जो डिजाइन पोषिदा है उससे ये उठता रहता है और जब हम वेफ क्रॉस फेंकते हैं तो वो कपड़ा भी बनाता है और डिजाइन भी बनाता है मजबूत करने के लिए हम में से कुछ लोग हैं जो इसको संभाले हुए हैं एक एक्सपीरियंस बुनकर 
जब एक साड़ी का सैंपल लेकर हमारे पास आता है तो उसके अंदर उसकी बूटियों को उसने कितनी बारीकी से काढ़ा है पीछे से वो साड़ी कितनी साफ बनी गई है साड़ी को जब वो वीव करते समय वो ठोकते हैं उसकी यूनिफॉर्मिटी कितनी है समान कलर का फ्लो वो होती है अच्छी वीविंग साड़ी की परत बहुत सालों से ना हमारे दिमाग में ये अपील आया करती थी कि इस व्यापार को इसका स्टैंडर्ड मेंटेन करते हुए आगे कैसे बढ़ाया जाए क्योंकि बनारसी साड़ी का जब भी नाम आता था तो हम हमेशा उसे एक न दुल्हन की साड़ी के रूप में देखा करते हाँ। थे जो कि औरतें अपनी लाइफ टाइम में शायद एक या दो बार खरीदेंगे अब मेरा मिशन ही यही है कि बनारसी साड़ी को हम यंग क्राउड के साथ फैशन के साथ कैसे कनेक्ट करें हम इसे ना कपड़ा क्यों न समझे जो एक यंग गर्ल इस्तेमाल करे हमारे बनारसी साड़ी में यान डाई करने के बाद साड़ी बनाते थे देन वी थॉट कि वाई डोंट वी डाई द साड़ी आफ्टर द साड़ी इज बिन गो विद कुछ ना कुछ डिफरेंट देने के लिए वेराइटी ऑफ द प्रोडक्ट वेराइटी ऑफ वी वेराइटी ऑफ कलर्स दिस वे वी नो इट सबसे इंपॉर्टेंट चीज ये है कि हम अपने आने वाली जनरेशन को क्या दे रहे हैं ऐसा नहीं हो सकता कि हम इतनी सुंदर चीजें हैंडलूम पे आज बनाए जो मेरी ग्रैंड डॉटर उसको पहने इसी सोच के साथ हम हैंडलूम को जिंदा रखना चाहते हैं Weaving has always fascinated me in general, how, especially hand. Obviously, there's not a lot of hand woven things. No, at least in America anymore, because we cost a lot. Uh, yes, uh, labor cost a, a ton here. Um, but just yeah, it's always fascinated me how they can make these intricate designs. Like I don't even quite still understand it. And I was just watching. I was like, I don't understand how you can get all those. I'm I'm looking for. There's there's several sites for what they claim are this kind of a sari. Sorry. But I would if I was looking for pricing and buying one, I would want it to be from yeah. that. It's probably it might be in the description here. Let's check here. Oh nope. Uh, it might have said the, their company. I guess at the beginning. I don't know. Maybe I don't know either. Why oh, you want to buy Andrew anyway? Yes. But shh, the secret. She hasn't watched the channel, but anyway. <laughs> um, but I also there... I also have no idea how much they cost. Neither do I. But when we went to India, everything was if you like buy them in in India, obviously it's much yeah much 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 much, much cheaper. Like uh, yeah, but I would want to support like yeah them. those guys yeah. Um, and I'm guessing just like dresses, there's different formal wears for right. each sari. I wouldn't know just based off, but I'm guessing it's probably to somebody who knows saris, it's probably as obvious as somebody just randomly wearing a wedding dress. Right. If you wore like a really fancy one. Right. And you're just out, it's like, why is she wearing a wedding dress right now? Exactly. Because there's a particular style to, and you guys I'm sure know this, to, to an American wedding dress, whether it's a white dress or not, they have a particular look and a particular quality to them. And they are almost always in the thousands of dollars mm -hmm. and they're a one-time wear yeah. and then you pass it down and i think it's neat that these seem to be more than just that they're wanting these to become and the typical i mean i guess it can be anything but the typical sorry for a wedding for for a woman is red right i believe that is correct because you don't white is funerals yeah yeah the white one's funerals yeah huh. yeah very 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 beautiful and yeah. i love um as we were watching this i was thinking to myself <laughs> How beautiful is it that we're not just getting informed, but I hope there's a lot of stupid babies watching this who are maybe seeing this for the first time and being reminded of something that is just intrinsic into their culture yeah. and preserving this. Because there's this balance between advancement but and balancing traditions. And there are certain things like that kind of handcrafted sari creation is something that should continue to be treasured. And that's an art form. Yeah. That's that's an art form as any of the musician musicians. Oh, 100%. Design that's, is a thousand percent an art form. And I had no idea it was that complex with those cards where they punch out the holes. Yeah, I thought they I had no idea how you made clothes in general. Wow. <laughs> like 
I can't do anything. My wife can sew. She can, like, I, I often ask her, I was like, do you think you can make, like, pants? She's like, yeah, I can make, seriously, I can make, yeah, she can make anything. Uh -huh. uh, and just like, she can cook anything. And I have zero idea how to do anything. Like, it, she's the smart one. Yeah. Like, by yeah. a thousand miles. That's true. <laughs> Like she had like a 5.0 GPA, if That's, you can get that. I was her teacher, <laughs> I can vouch for that, it's true. And she was the, literally, if you would have asked any of her teachers, who is your best student? It was my wife. Was and you probably asked them who was their worst student. <laughs> Ain't that funny how life works. <laughs> <laughs> you, mar you married up. Uh, and so, also, another video that I was planning on doing a while ago that we still need to do, we need to try on sorry's. We've been talking about that since the day we did those The clothes. other one that I wanted to do, uh, uh, us wearing saris, trying them and trying to figure out how to put them on. Yeah. We, obviously, we didn't do very well with dodies. Uh, yeah, we're going to do even worse with the sari. Yeah, yeah, and I've seen how those get on, and that's not an Absolutely. easy thing to accomplish. But I remember that was almost uh, over a year ago that we were <sighs> well, talking about. Well, in advance of that video, sorry, get it? Pun there on the sorry about the sorry. <clears throat> Da <laughs> <laughs>